What's up everybody? Welcome back to Coasters and Coasters. If you're new here, my name is Isaac. This is Molly. We are traveling all around the Los Angeles area, currently looking for really great cheap eats. Before we get into the video, make sure to hit the like button, give us a thumbs up, and subscribe to stay up to date on all our adventures. So usually for these Cheap Eats videos, we like to highlight small businesses or family owned joints, and we don't usually hit up fast food. But we're gonna make an exception for this place because we really want to give it a try. That's right, we are trying out Jollibee today. They just put a new one in, in the city of Alhambra. It's kind of located in between Los Angeles and the San Gabriel Valley. It's a great quiet community. There's awesome Asian restaurants, great dim sum places. And we had so much fun at Dollar Hits trying Filipino food. We wanted to kind of keep that streak rolling and try some Filipino fast food. So let's go in and order some fried chicken and see what else they got. It's Super Bowl Sunday today, so you know I wanted to get some fried chicken. I also wanted to rep my favorite football team, Sounders Football Club. So we're here at Jollibee, home of the Chicken Joy and we're gonna try their famous fried chicken. And I know that um, they're really big on gravy, so I'm gonna try it, dipping it in the gravy. Wow. This fried chicken is really good. It's seriously crispy. The thing that I like about it is that the uh, breading isn't too much. Like sometimes you get the extra crispy or something from KFC, and it, it's a lot of breading to work through. This is so good, the flavor is great. Dipping in the gravy is a must. Um, awesome. You definitely gotta get this if you come. So Isaac, now that you've had the chicken, do you feel the joy? I am overcome with joy. I feel like a jelly bean. <laughs> so this fried chicken is so good. They call it chicken joy. It makes us happy when we eat it. <laughs> but uh, there's so many great places to get fried chicken. So many great fast food restaurants. It's even been like elevated. There's upscale places doing fried chicken. And honestly, like grocery store fried chicken can be really good too. Where is your favorite spot to get fried chicken? Put it in the comments below. So after their famous fried chicken, the other thing Jollibee is really famous for is their spaghetti. And it looks wild. It's got the noodles and the sauce and some cheese on top. But then you've also got these like little slices of hot dogs. It just looks really crazy. I can't wait to try it. Let's go. Okay, I think I managed to get a little bit of everything in this bite. So I heard someone mention that this spaghetti is sweet and they were not lying. It is really, uh, it's unique. I've never had spaghetti like this in my life. The sauce and the noodles are the texture you'd think but it's a much sweeter flavor and uh, I kind of like it actually. And the little bits of hot dog or whatever little sausages in there, those are really yummy too. Mm -hmm. So, I say get this when you come to Jollibee, but just come at it with new taste buds. Don't expect it to taste like your average spaghetti. Be ready for something new and you'll love it. I sure do. <laughs> The last entree we're gonna try is called the Palabac Fiesta. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, but uh, let's give it a try. It's got rice noodles, hard boiled egg, some shrimp, some pork. It looks, looks pretty good to me, um, so let's try it. Okay, I'm trying to get everything on this bite. Mm, that is different. Not in, not in a bad way. Don't let my reaction fool you. I um, I just wasn't expecting it. It's it's interesting. It's not like overly sweet. It's not like overly spicy. In fact, I would say there's there's no like spicy flavor to it. I, I meant spicy in the sense of like something being spiced. Um, it's good. It's really good. It's different. I, I don't think I've ever had anything quite like this before. Molly, I think you should try this and then like see what you think. It's very, it's very different. It's not, it's unlike anything I've had, certainly from a fast food restaurant. Sure, I'll give it a try. Oh, 
that smells amazing. You know, I can see why this would be a surprising flavor because it's a surprising combination of ingredients. Oh, I ate both pieces of egg. I'm sorry. Greedy. It's a really yummy, meaty, savory flavor. I love these little skinny rice noodles. They're so good at soaking up flavor. I think what we're tasting that's so unique is that in the Filipino cuisine, they're not afraid to combine different meats for a unique flavor. Um, so this, I, I actually love this. This might be my favorite thing I've tried so far. Um, what was it called, Isaac? Palabok. Palabok. The Palabok Fiesta. I would really recommend getting this, especially if you want to try a whole new set of flavors and textures. This is super tasty. If you've been around us for a while, you know we're not ones to skip dessert. So we got their classic peach mango pie. Let's get in there. Look at that filling. Okay, the chicken was good. The spaghetti was good. The palabak I thought was delicious, but this is what brings the joy for me. The peach mango filling on the inside of this is delicious. Um, you know, this, this little mini pie reminds me of the ones you get at McDonald's, except this is like a hundred times better. Oh, do not skip the peach mango pie because, like I said, this is the source of all chicken joy. <laughs> we are washing everything down today with this kind of uh, pineapple quencher juice. Um, it's kind of like an upcharge. I think it's like 50 cents more than if you get a Pepsi product, a soft drink. This is so good. It is very sweet. Word, word of caution there. Um, if you're not into things that are super sweet, this is very sweet. It would be awesome with a little something mixed in, but it's delicious. So what do you think? Are we coming back? Yes, and I think I'm getting the gist of why this works so well. So when you come and you get a few different items from the menu like we did to taste, you get this incredible combination of sweet and salty, sweet and savory. Um, I can see how if you came and just got the spaghetti, that might be a little bit of a kind of throw you off experience. But if you come and you get the fried chicken with the gravy, some sweet spaghetti, the pala box, some dessert, you get to have that magic experience of sweet, salty, sweet, salty. We're all about it and we love it. We will definitely be coming back and this definitely fits on our Cheap Eats list. We ordered a bunch of different things to try. I think we spent about 20 bucks for all of it, but I could see how someone could come on their own and spend well under 10 bucks to get quite a lot of food. So fantastic Cheap Eats, and it makes it on the short list of really good fast food places for us. Well, Coaster friends, thank you so much for spending time with us on this Super Bowl Sunday. We had so much fun trying Jollibee, getting some more Filipino food in there. Um, and until we see you here next time, we just want to say, Cheers! Cheers.